HCR, Hawkeye Creek Ranch. It is late on Thursday afternoon, May 22nd, 2014, and this is Hawkeye, Saskatchewan. Now a ranch mainly owned by Brian Drackett. You can see the right-of-way over there that the Canadian National laid through here in 1929 to connect Shellbrook with Turtleford through Spirit Road. This is all glacial outwashing through here, really sandy soil. Just good for pasturage and bush. The uh, rail line was abandoned in 1980-81, the steel was pulled up. And this looks to be the town site down in here, although there never was a town. There was a, a school, the Hawkeye School District was erected in 1915, but I don't know where the building was. There was a rural post office of Hawkeye established on January the 1st, 1917, and closed on November the 1st, 1929, when the new post office opened on the town site. And it was closed on October 31st, 1961. Ranching settlers began trickling into this area at the beginning of the 20th century. The Stuarts, Bears, Nichols, McRory's, Wyman's, Knights, Aylesworth. Most of them were from Iowa, the Hawkeye State, hence the name. That road goes up to the Karpinski's Ranch. CN built a freight passenger shelter in 1930 at mile 24.1 from Shellbrook on what it called its Amiens sub, Shellbrook to Medstead, 75 miles. The station was sold off in 1963. Initially, it was called Laywood. This is trackside down here. You can see the foundations of the elevators. There is two of them. Saskatchewan Wheat Pool number 954 was built in 1927 and torn down in 1943. And Searle built in 1928 and it was torn down in 1939. In the days of steam, there was a water tank here to replenish the locomotives. Hawkeye was never incorporated as a village or anything. It was always just a hamlet, a ward of the rural municipality of Canwood, number 494. Hawkeye, Saskatchewan.